Hey everybody, it's Jen with Two Sister Bees. Welcome to the channel. I am so excited about today's video because not only did we have a lot of stuff going on, but as you can see, I am set up in a whole new place. I am in my house in Florida. I am so excited to be here. First of all, we're at my kitchen counter. I do not have my desk here yet, so welcome to my kitchen. And second, I went around the house and grabbed some items to make a setup for you guys today. We are not skipping these savings challenges. And we have so much stuff going on in today's video. The first thing we're gonna do is my sister sent me everything that is part of the MVB and the Scratch Off Club for this month so i'm so excited to open this up with you guys i have not seen this this will be the first time that i see it all put together just like you so we're going to get into this packet we're going to play all the games we're going to play all the scratch offs we're going to see all of the stuff i'm so excited about this the money that i'll be using today is 150 dollars, and this money that i'm using to play these games is going to end up over here in my 100 envelope challenge then, even more exciting, we are gonna unstuff this box. And we'll talk about that more when we get to that part of the video. And last but not least, you know we've gotta play Hello Honey. Today's version is called Destiny Is All. If you know, you already know. If you don't, let's get into it and find out. Okay, so let's count up this money and make sure I have $150. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, and 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50, 150. And you guys, this is so funny. I, just now when I was counting this, I owned this house when we first started the channel, but, and I visited here as well, but I've never actually filmed in this house. This is the very first time. Oh my goodness, this is so exciting. Okay, so we're gonna put this to the side just like this because I don't have my money tray. If this is your first time watching Two Sister Bees, welcome to the hive and let me explain just really quick. I just moved from Northern California all the way over to South Florida. We just got here last week and side note, probably a very important note, we purchased back the house that we sold a year and a half ago. So that's why I'm so excited in case you're new and you're like, what is this lady talking about? That's what I'm talking about. So we've got our 150 over here and let's get to these games. Let's see what April sent us. I'm so excited. Okay, so everything for the scratch off club is in here. This is the packet that will be mailed to you. It all comes in this envelope. This is what you'll actually receive in the mail. And we're gonna get to that in just one second. And you guys, like I said, I haven't seen any of this yet all put together. So I'm pretty excited about this as well. And I'm not even gonna waste any time. We're just gonna start playing these games. The first one is Sunflower Savings. This one is a freebie if you are in the MVB club or the Scratch Off Club. So whichever one you're in, this one is free. Everything that April makes always comes with the bank envelope, the A6 and the A5 dashboard. So those are all there with every single game. And let's see how to play Sunflower Savings. You save $3 for every color you use to complete the picture. Okay, so what I think I'm gonna do is, let's roll the dice. I don't know if you guys can hear him, but Uhtred is over there kind of whining. I think he wonders who I'm talking to. I'm not sure, I'm not sure. What is it, Bubbies? Are you hungry? Do you want mom to get you some foods? Hold on, you guys, I'm gonna see if maybe he's hungry. I'll be right back. Okay, I made him a bowl of food. He's got grated Pecorino Romano cheese on there. That's how spoiled this dog is. He will not eat <laughs> unless he has sprinkled cheese. So here's Uhtred's food. I'm gonna go give this to him. Okay, so let's roll the dice. I'm gonna do however many colors the dice says. Let's find out. Of course, six. <laughs> What other number could it be, right? Okay, so I'm gonna use six different colors. That means we will save six times three, $18. 
I went to the Dollar Tree today and picked up just a pack of five markers. That's crazy. Of course, there's only five. Maybe we can add this little Sharpie in to make this six. All right, that'll work. So let's go ahead and color something. And side note, Uhtred was hungry. He's over there eating, so that is what he was crying about. I wasn't sure if he was wondering who I was talking to because he was looking at me like I was pretty crazy. So you guys, while I'm coloring, I'm gonna tell you so much has been going on since we have been home. We have had every vendor you could possibly imagine in the house. We had the window guy here because our windows need replaced. We had the fence guy here. Jason wants to extend the fence a little bit. We had the pressure washer guy here. He pressure washed the entire house and the driveway and all of that. We had the pest control company here and they sprayed the yard. Uh, who else? I know there's more than that. We ha Oh, we had Stanley Steamer here and they did uh, our outside patio furniture and a couple of the area rugs. And I think that's it. We didn't have them do a whole lot. So they were here. It seems like every single day, someone else has been in this house doing something. Okay, so we've used three colors so far. Let's do... Oh my goodness, I, co <laughs> I colored that terrible. Okay, so that's four colors. And this will be five colors. And Uhtred is done eating, so he expects two cookies. Here they are. Let's go give these to Uhtred. Okay, and the last color would be blue. And let's color, what can we color blue? Let's see. Let's do the center of this flower. Okay, so that is $18 for sunflower savings. Let's get that. 10, 15, 16, 17, and 18. Let's put this to the side. And the next game is Cottage Cash. This one I really like because first of all, it's super cute. And second, there are quite a few different things to do on this one. Up at the top, it's pour yourself a cup, roll the dice and save the amount rolled and just write it over here on a teacup. These are two little bonus ones. You color those in and they are worth $10 a piece. The mason jars, you choose whether you want them to be worth five, 10 or $20, whatever your budget is this week. And down here, the house is saved two or five for each color that you use to fill in the cottage. So much going on on this one, which is awesome. So let's start with rolling the dice. Gotta love the dice. And that is three. So let's write $3 on the little teapot over there. and put the three to the side. And then this one, these are $10 per cup. So I'm gonna go ahead and put 10 over for that. And let's color one in. I wish I had more colors, but this will just have to work, right? It's better than nothing. So of course, April and I are really excited about the clubs, the scratch off and the MVB. The MVB club is $5 per month and that gives you the freebie that we just played, this game and the next game I'm gonna do at half price, which is $1.50 for the month. And it gives you access to the club library, which April is gonna be adding who knows what, at random times, you will have access to that. She wants me to let you know she's got lots of surprises in store for that club library. She's actually pretty excited about getting that filled up for you guys. Okay, so the next step is I'm gonna make one of these mason jars worth $5 today. And another thing I like about this game is this one could last you quite a while. This one 
will end up being some really good savings when you're done. Okay, and the last part is, of course, the little cottage. I'm gonna do $2 and just do one color today. Two. And let's put, let's do the green and color the hedges over here. Okay, so we are all done with Cottage Cash and same as the other games, this one comes with the A5 and A6 and the bank envelope, nice. And the next one that's part of the club is these trackers. These are actually my favorite. You cut these out and they will fit right into your A6 envelopes. And we've got $1, 5, 10, 20. I love this one, it's all different. And this one is super cool. You can put whatever you want on the last one. So this is really awesome. I think I'm going to two of the $20 ones. I wish I had purple, but I don't. Let's go with blue. And I think I'm just gonna do a check mark on those. So I know I have two of those done. Okay, so next we're gonna get into this envelope and see what we get. This is too cute. I love the little cottage, the little bee. So here's what it's gonna look like when you receive it in your mailbox. And let's open this up. And April will be here, uh, what is today? Okay, so April will be here next week and her and I are gonna get all of these together for you guys. We are so excited about being able to spend some time together and doing something fun and new and exciting for two sister bees. We've got our Scratch Off Club member card and of course she's got a savings challenge on the back here. And you know what I like about these is I don't have my binders with me, but these are perfect for the little pockets in the front of the binders. That's where I'm gonna put mine. And then we've got this cute little bookmark, home is where the honey is. And again, gotta have that savings challenge on the back. Thank you, April. Oh yes, here it is. Oh, the mini scratch off. I cannot wait to start scratching this off. Here is the club relaunch card, April, 2024. These will be in every single one. And I think they are so cute as like little collectibles, color and save $1 for every color you use to finish the picture. I love these bees. I just think they are so cute. And then we've got the big scratch off cottage cash, scratch and follow the guide on the back. Let's just do this, right? So here's the back and each thing is a different prompt. Let's get scratching. Okay, let me get a quarter. And I've got all this cash over here to the side to do most of this with you. I think I can do it. Let's see how much we get. Okay, the first one is a basket. Let's flip it over and see what it says. Scratch a flower basket or hat? Yes, we did. Save based on the current month. Dollar for January, two for February, etc. I am in March, so that is going to be $3. I don't know why I said I'm in March. We're, <laughs> we're all in March. Okay, let's go a couple more times. Let's see how far we can get. Now, when you guys are doing this, it will be April because these are getting mailed out, I think the last week of March, so that you'll be receiving them in April. Next is a teapot. And if you scratch a teapot, you save based on the current season. And we are in spring, so that is another dollar. One, let's keep going. Okay, for the third one, we got the cute little bunny rabbit. Let's see what he says. He is save based on the current time of day. Morning is $3, afternoon is five, night is seven. It is afternoon here, so that is worth $5. Next is the flower pot. And that one says, roll as many dice as you wish and save the amount rolled in bills or coins. Okay, let's get two dice. Let's do two. 
eight dollars there's the eight we're gonna put it over here to the side and I don't think I told you guys how much this is okay so let's <laughs> let's talk about that for a second the scratch off club is the is when you get the envelope that I just opened and all of the things I showed you mailed to you that is $17 that includes all of the games we just played that includes the sunflower savings that is the free one and you also get the other two games at half price for the entire month Oh, and the important thing, you get access to the kits. Those, we only had 20 for Cozy, for this month of Cozy Cottage, but next month we will have 100 kits available for you guys. So you have access to those as well. And the library, and as I said, April will be consistently adding to that library, and I will too. I don't come up with quite as much as April does, but I do sometimes, so some of my stuff will be in there as well for you. And this is a little bit of a secret, but there is going to be some very exciting things coming up next month that you will have access to. I don't want to give it away completely, but you guys are going to love it. Okay, so next we got this cute little birdhouse. And this one says, save a dollar for every letter of what day it is. Today is Friday, so that is $6. Six. I'm filming on Friday, you're watching on Sunday. And let's see. Let's go a couple more times because we can't forget I still have to scratch off the little one. So I don't want to run out of money quite yet. Let's do... Let's do two more of this one. Okay, we've got the mason jar, and that one's the same as the bunny. You save on the time of day, which is afternoon, five bucks, five. And let's go one more, and then we'll start the mini tiny scratch off. Okay, and it's a cute little bird. Okay, and the bird is the letter of the day as well. Today's Friday, six bucks, six. The only one that we didn't get to scratch off was one of these. And that one is based off of your current weather. Sun is 10, rain is 20, anything else is worth five. So we only missed one. Let's go to the mini scratch off. I love this. And April will be making one of these and one of these, same size, every month. And what I like about them is they're like little collectible cards and you can keep playing them even after you've scratched them. April has tons of ideas for you guys to keep using these. So let's start scratching. Let's see what we get here. These are so cute. I don't think I've ever scratched a little tiny mini one like this before. Okay, this one is $11. 11. And this one is eight, eight, two, one, four. So I'm going to put the five and put one back. I'm down to. $12 over here, you guys can't see, but that's how much I have left. So there's nine, which leaves me with $3. Ah, I scratched a seven. So I would actually owe $4 to this scratch off, but today doesn't really count because as I said, all of this cash that we played with today is going into my 100 envelope challenge. But before we do that, I have a couple more things from the club to show you. So let's move this out of the way for one second because April also added these for you guys. I did not know what these were. I actually had to text her and ask her, like, what are we doing with these? And she let me know that last time we did the Scratch Off Club, you guys were asking for these. So she made them. This way you can save up and budget for the Scratch Off Club and the MVB Club. You can make this part of your budget binder. I love it and they are so cute. So those are available for you guys as well. These are both free downloads. So no matter which one you're in, you can download these and have them ready to go. 
And today, Sunday, is the last day for you guys to sign up for this cozy cottage theme. Tonight at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, these will be cut off and April and I are gonna start packing them up. I cannot wait. So if you haven't already and you're thinking about it, today's the day to go over there and sign up. Okay, let's see what is going on with this. I am going to take this $200 Okay, it's not 200, it's 150. I don't know why I said 200. It's $150. I'm taking the 150 that we used to play all of those games with today. This money is going into my 100 envelope challenge. If you've been following along, you know that I have not completed this challenge. There are more envelopes that need to be stuffed, but as I said, I just moved across country and I kinda need the cash that is in this box. Just the pod alone cost close to $4,000 to have shipped. And you guys, I think that is about what is in this box, $4,000. So I need that cash back. So let's get started. And I always say that about savings challenges, you know, like even if you haven't completely finished it, it doesn't matter. Cause you know what? It's your money, you saved it up. And when you need it, take it <laughs> and I need it. We have spent so much on this move and getting into the house. Obviously the hotels, the gas, the food. Oh my goodness, you guys, it is really adding up. And I have to say that Jason is taking a little break from work. He has done, um, if you're new to the channel, and you don't know, Jason works anywhere between 60 to sometimes 80 hours every week. And he has been doing that for four years straight. That has gotten us completely out of debt, which we're so excited about. And the car is paid off and all of these great things. So I think that hubby definitely deserves a little time off. So we are tapping into some of our stash here so that we can enjoy ourselves back home in sunny Florida. And as I said, we've got April coming to visit and I have other family members that live close by and we just want to enjoy ourselves for a little while. <laughs> I don't know how long, but before we get back to the grind, you guys, we just want to take a little break. Jason's actually out in the pool right now. I'm looking at him. He's uh, sitting out there on the edge of the pool, just enjoying life. And uh, I have to say, I love to see that. He is such a good husband and I'm so blessed to have him. He is all about taking care of everyone. Okay, so I think all of these envelopes are empty because I rubber banded the cash on the back. I feel like I, I still feel like I have to check. I don't know why. I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, there's the money. Okay. And these are the same way. There's the cash. There's the cash. There it is. Okay. Putting this all back in the box is going to be ugh, time consuming, but it's okay. I'll sit and do that while I'm watching TV one night, get all these numbered envelopes back in order. Okay, so I am going to reluctantly, because I love to talk, uh, be quiet and fast forward so I can get this money in order. I'll be right back. And after I am done counting up all of the money, we're gonna play Hello Honey. I cannot wait to play today's version. I think you guys are gonna love it. And a completed 
100 envelope challenge is worth $5,050. So we will see just how close I came. I know I was pretty close. Uh, almost done. <laughs> this doesn't seem that long to you because I'm on a time lapse, but this is taking quite some time. Okay, <laughs> let's count this up. I'm gonna move this mess out of the camera. Yeah, let's clean up a little bit, right? Okay. And I also do not have my calculators. So I will be adding this up on a piece of paper. Okay, you guys ready to start counting? Oh my goodness. Here's my paper, here's my pen. Oh, let's start counting it up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. So there's 2100, that's a good start. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 950. And in 20s, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 720, 40, 60, 760. Tens, we have 110, 20, 30, 40, 140. Fives, we have 100. Sixty-five ones. I'm probably gonna speed these up, you guys. Ready? Seventy-two. All right. Now you know what we gotta do, right? We gotta check it out just for a minute. This is a long time in the making. I'm not even sure how long I've been doing this 100 envelope challenge. There it all is. It'll stand up on its own. <laughs> Let's add this up. Okay, you guys, in my chicken scratch handwriting, I have $4,187. Yay! That's actually just a little bit more than what I thought I had. So let's see. I was $863 short of the challenge. That is not bad. I am very happy with that. I am happy that I saved up $4,187. Yay. And this will pay for the pod for our moving cash. No credit, you guys. That is the best feeling ever. Yes. It's already spent. <laughs> But that's okay, right? I don't even care. I'm so glad that I have it. Thank you, Jesus. All right. Okay, you guys, it is time to play Hello, Honey. If you're new to Two Sister Bees and you've never played before, Hello, Honey is an interactive game. We play it here every Sunday. It's something completely different. Down below, there is a tracker, a little game like this that you can click on and print out. I don't have Hello Honey with me, but this is kind of the same thing. It is a sheet that you can print out and keep track each week of how much you save. That is linked below. 
So if you've never played before, start today. Okay, I'll try. And today's version, as I said, is called Destiny is All. What does that mean? Let's go to the clip and Jason and I will explain it. Destiny is all. That is today's Hello Honey. Why am I calling it Destiny is all? You guys are going to love this. My all-time favorite show is on Netflix and it is called The Last Kingdom. The star of that show is named Uhtred. <laughs> and I have named my English Bulldog after my favorite character on The Last Kingdom. So if you don't already know, this is my buddy, Uhtred, and we are going to see if we can figure out what Uhtred's destiny is. Huh, bubbies? What is your destiny? And how we're gonna do that is this. So Uhtred doesn't know it yet, but he is destined to eat some little treats on this appetizer plate that I have ready for him. <laughs> And we're gonna do three rounds. We're gonna have the sweet potato and the watermelon is round one. His favorite treat and a piece of cheddar cheese is round two. A chunk of ground beef and some cream cheese is round three. So you guys decide how much you want each round to be worth. Is it a dollar a piece, $5 a piece, $50 a piece? Whatever is in your budget, figure out how much you wanna make each round worth. And we're gonna start with the sweet potato and the watermelon. I'm gonna lay those both down in front of Uchi and he seems awful hungry because he is standing at the entrance of the kitchen by his bowl right now. So I'm gonna say he's pretty hungry. So you guys pick which one you think little Mr. Uhtred is gonna eat first. Will he go for the sweet potato? Will he go for the watermelon? And you know what, let's put answer C in there because he might not take either one. We don't know what Uhtred is gonna do. Let me lay down that sweet potato and the watermelon and let's see what he does. He's going to the sweet potato. Nope. Watermelon. Nope. <laughs> he doesn't want either one. Okay, Mother. so the answer is going to be C. He doesn't want either one. Uchi, come here. Come here, bobies. Let's see if I hand him. Nope. Okay. That is official. His destiny for round one is C. Neither one. Let's go to round two. Okay, Uchi. Is any trickery going to be had on round two? He's definitely waiting. He might even know what is up here, right, you guys? He might smell it. Okay, so is he gonna go for his favorite treat or a chunk of cheddar cheese? Or again, let's throw it in there, C, neither one. Hold on, bubbies, wait. All right, cheese wins. <laughs> he is definitely eating the cheese. And then the treats, good boy. <laughs> okay, let's go to round three. <laughs> He's a good boy. Okay, we are down to two of Uhtred's favorite things, cream cheese and a chunk of ground beef. Which one do you guys think he's gonna eat first? And the option, and option C is always available too, but I don't think we're gonna need it on this round. <laughs> Pretty sure he's gonna eat one of these first. Sit, good boy, wait. Cream cheese and ground beef. Okay, go. He didn't even sniff that cream cheese. I am shocked. He went for the ground beef first. <laughs> And then the cream cheese. Okay, ground beef wins that round. Thank you, Uchis. You helped us play Hello Honey today. 
Yeah, I have cream cheese on my fingers. He's a good boy. Thanks, Uchis. Okay, you guys, Jason is joining us now because we are getting ready to do the bonus round. And this is how we're gonna do it. This is again, Uhtred's destiny. And what we're gonna do with him this time is we're gonna put him in between the two of us, in between his mom and his dad. And you guys choose, is he gonna run to me or is he gonna go to Jason? <laughs> Which one do you think he's gonna go to? We've got Uchi down here between us and we are gonna sprint in two different directions and we will see who he follows. One, two, three. <laughs> Who's he gonna go to? Bubby, is he gonna come see mamas? What about dad? Oh, come see mamas. Who's a mama's boy? <laughs> He's good. What about oh, dad? Oh, you little <laughs> What about your dad? All right. Jason wins. He ran to his dad. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. All right. You want some more treats? All right. Here, Bobby. Here, Bobby. Come here. Sit. Give me knuckles. Good boy. Give me knuckles. Good boy, Bubbies. Thanks, Uchis. Okay, you guys, Uhtred's destiny was round number one, he chose nothing. Round number two was the chunk of cheddar cheese. And round number three was the ground beef. In the bonus round, he chose Jason. Jason. <laughs> okay, you guys. Thanks for playing. Back to the video. <laughs> Okay, you guys, how was today's version of Hello, Honey? I hope you guys liked playing along with our little baby, Uhtred. A few of you missed him last week and said he should definitely be included this week. So there was our little guy, star of Hello, Honey, today. Add up all of your answers. Comment below what you saved today so that I know how much I'm going to save. I average out all of your answers, and that will be my total. I have two weeks now of Hello Honey to catch up on and get square with you guys next week. And this week, the pod will be here, which means I will have all of my things back and, and the channel can get back to normal. I'm so excited. I have missed the budgeting. I have missed the cash stuffing. If you liked these games that we played today and you want to maybe treat yourself to something fun, a little gift every month in the mail that will keep saving fresh and interesting for you, look in the description below. I will have the sign up link down below. Next month, as I said, the theme is one that has been asked about for quite some time, and there are some extra surprises that are going to go along with that packet. As always, thanks for hanging out with me today. Click here and keep watching Two Sister Bees.